Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be doing the vlog set. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> I'm with my mom today, and you guys wouldn't believe this. This is our seventh mom tag. Our very first mom tag came out April 5th, 2014, and today is April 18th, 2020. So literally six years later, we usually do something super fun, like whipped cream, <laughs> water. Painting. Look at all the clowns. The first one we didn't do anything. Yeah. Right. I wanted to bring it back to the first video ever and just like bring it back to the class question and answer, but it's a whole different mom tag. So I compiled, I think, like 14 or 15 questions for her to answer. Describe each of your children in one word. Carlos. <laughs> Self-absorbed. Sean. Angel. Brenna. I first thing I came in my mind was cuddly because I just wanted to give her a big squeeze. <laughs> but to describe her. Loving. Tori. Stubborn. Who does that remind you of? Brooks. Sweet. Skylar. Demanding. PJ. Smiling. Share a moment in which I've made you laugh. Oh my god. Just I made you laugh all the time. <laughs> Remember last night? Um, <laughs> yes. Oh. oh my god. I couldn't stop laughing for the rest of the day. We went to a festival. It was around Halloween time. And Brenna likes fried Oreos. She loves fried Oreos. They were selling. You guessed it, fried Oreos. I was gonna go get some. So she said, how much for? Three. It was like three. I thought it was two. This was my junior year of high school, like the very beginning. She asked the price, and apparently she didn't like the price. So she yelled. Brenna doesn't yell. She's very non-confrontational. She's just like me. Very much. Go with the flow. I'm not gonna cause a scene. It's not a big deal. Well, that day, Brenna was out of her breath. She said, what? For two or three? Fried Oreos? What did you say? I said, that's a rip off. That's yeah. a it was like a full tantrum standing up. She stops her feet and she does this with her arms. She's like, that's a rip off. It was like three Oreos for like $12, bro. After we had left and the shock kind of left, I just started Fabiani was up. dying. He was dying the whole time. It was just not you. And it was just the over fried Oreos. So one admirable habit that each of your children had. Carlos is a go-getter. Sean was a giver. Brenna. You wait for nobody. Tori. Boss. Brooke. Dependable. Yeah. Skyler. <laughs> I'm getting to you. You seven down the list, so chill. Skyler. Energized. He's funny. <laughs> yeah. Unintentionally. Where do you see me in 10 years? Oh, being a teacher. Yeah. I think you'll still be around. I can't imagine leaving you guys in all honesty. I can't imagine her leaving me. And if <laughs> she does, I might follow her. Her friend be like, why is she standing on my porch all the time? I'm throwing bread at her, but she won't leave. What's the best present I've ever given you? Oh, hands down. It was Can a pack. Oh. <laughs> Good guess. Oh, the pack of pens? Yes. No way. Yeah. What? Like a pack of three notebooks. Very cute ones. And then a big thing <laughs> of pens. It's also the thought behind. So when she bought me these pens, she was a kid, like a little, little kid. She only had a couple dollars in her pocket. So she spent it all on me. Which made it even more special. You should have seen her face when she gave it to me. She's just so proud. It was the best. Tell about a moment I filled your eyes with tears. No. Was it yesterday? No. Oh. Well, that was one. Oh, God. I wasn't expecting that. Are you okay? You know what it is. Whenever I cry, it's overwhelming. How much you do and how much I need you and how much I can count on you. Thinking about that is a good thing. I don't think anybody gets that in a daughter. To have two kids. Yeah. She's going to school. She's got a job. I got to go to my job, too. She tag teams with me. She cares for them a lot whenever I have to work. It's a lot. What was your favorite food while pregnant with me? Snickers. Snickers? So Snickers. Milky Way. Oh, that's what it was. I'm sorry. I had a Milky Way every night with Brenna. Do you ever wish that I would marry a quarter? to your choice. No. What's the best memory you have of us? We're still making amazing memories. What's the best memory you have of us so far? The first thing that pops up in my head, which is really weird, because I wouldn't consider it the best, but it was fun. We went to go try out a new taco place. The mood was great, the vibe was great. What is the worst thing I've ever done? I don't know, she's a pretty good kid. I don't know, I haven't caught you lying to me. Bro. Quentin caught you lying to him, but I already knew. I went to go to my boyfriend's house, and I told Quentin I'm going to my friend's house, but I had told my mom over the phone prior to, I'm going to my boyfriend's house house but I'm telling Quentin I'm going to my friend's house but when he found out I was like mom knew already he got upset you let her lie to me yeah yeah I did <laughs> compared to the last two years bro like it's gorgeous dude it's so flat today but it was so nice in that <gasps> other mom's head oh my god the worst thing you've ever done to me I just came to me she was in Texas she told me specifically over the phone she did not want to come back she wanted to stay in Texas and I lost my Mine. Called the lawyer. <laughs> I was bribed with dance, guys. He said if I stay in Texas, I can dance. And I wanted to dance. I want to dance. 
I'm sorry. <laughs> you know what? I think we'd be on that. <laughs> if Brenna leaves today, my whole life would stop. Because she is so embedded in my guys, life. She's a, she's a partner. I'm going to Hawaii, but <laughs> what is a habit? Of mine? I wish I didn't have undecisiveness. Oh, I wish I didn't have that too. But you're undecisive too, though. Yeah. But we're not talking about. What do you want for lunch? I don't know. What do you want? We're not talking know. about. Me. You saw how she did that, right? I'm probably the most indecisive person you'll ever meet in your life. Like I'll sit down and be like, tell me what to do because I can't choose. What is something I've taught you? You've taught me how to be a twerk master. More open-minded. Oh, for real? Yeah. No way. Tell me how to be calmer. She's like my anti-anxiety. Name something I obsess over. <laughs> you know why she's telling me that. Oh yeah, I'm gonna play it back. Number ten. What is something I obsess over? Nick. <gasps> oh, I wasn't supposed to say that. What is one thing I'm obsessed with? Eddie. <laughs> Nowadays, I think you obsess over peace. She's very into herself. Time. I would say. But he's, he's not very obsessive worthy. Why'd you say that? You can edit this shit, whatever you don't want to do. <laughs> edit, edit, edit. So, yeah, probably your piece. You obsess over that, which is not a bad thing at all. You think I make time to myself too much? At times? Sometimes I worry about that. That was a better answer than a boy. Yeah, well, this year it's better. I mean, boys, <laughs> y'all did yeah. some numbers on some great girls. I think boys just they hurt you so much now. There's no boy to obsess over. With your last relationship, you're talking to a guy that you're never going to see. He couldn't see you, he just didn't want to see you. So it. you categorized them instead of obsessing over them and giving them your heart. That's all I'm saying. So y'all messing up. If you get all these. SpongeBob. I'm ready, I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't count. Oh! Yeah! Red ones are lucky. It's like a little. Is it a seal? <laughs> you toss a little. Stand here with me so we do the outro. We caught him just like that. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is our seventh mom tag. If you haven't seen all the rest of them, all of them will be linked down below. Watch our evolution. You made me so tall. Like we're only 5'9, five 5'8. Five She's 5'8. 5'9. I tell people I'm 5'9. I'm just way short. Catch you in the next video.